hydrated, especially after finishing the cardiorespiratory efficiency test. I feel very proud. I did it. I got the ultimate score. I completed 30 minutes. That gave me 30 points. You can't do better than that. So I feel very proud. Now the cool part is I calculated everything on my polar heart rate monitor. So now I have documentation for what I did. So check this out. I did a total of 33 minutes. That's what the duration says. The total calories say 418 calories. I busted out 418 calories. Now I can even see what my average heart rate was. It was 132 beats. So I averaged 132 beats per minute. The maximum heart rate was 156 beats per minute. Now that's pretty cool. I have that documented so I'll always know that's what I did. So now my goal for next week is to once again get the ultimate score, get 30 points, but now I want to lower my average heart rate and I want to lower my maximum heart rate. So it means my body's not trying so hard. I'm getting in even better shape. That's pretty cool. So I'm excited. I did it. I can't wait to do it next week and I know you can too. If you feel the pounding on your joints and bones or a little too much, remember go into the exercise modifications video because I want everyone there's no intimidation. I want everyone to be able to do this test, and I know you can. So remember, it's a game. Try to beat your previous high score every time you play. That's what makes this game so motivating and inspiring to do with your friends and family. Com compete. I tell you, compete against yourself every week. You're going to get great results. So have a great day, and remember to do the cardiorespiratory efficiency test next week on your day one.